Assalamualaikum. So I myself presenter from Group One H. My name is Nurul Zainal Jibayadi. My metric number one nine one one eight zero. So basically, our group has choose water level controller by using fuzzy logic. So let me intro intro first. So actually, um, combined water tank system I use in many resident area, but sometimes they not functioning well, such as their inflow system, inflow rate does not meet the out, output rate, so uh, the water level doesn't get the desired parameter. So uh, this is our example of water test. This is the mathematical equation. So. So this one, we make a mathematical equation and then put it the T and the K in the transfer function for the first order differential equation and then we got the TS. And then the simulate. So we get the simulate. So we open the system using SL10 and then the LL10 will pop out. So this is our diagram for SL10. So first, we need to put all the rules and parameter into the fuzzy logic controller. So this is how we make it. So in our group, we have one, one, two input and one output. First is level, second is red, and the other one is bulb. So for the level, the range of fuzzy logic the range is fuzzy logic between negative 1 to 1 and then for the rate is negative 0 0.1 to 0 0.1 and for the output we have negative 1 to 1 so basically fuzzy logic in the simplest way if you want to understand it it's like you want something maybe you want something okay you want something like fast food uh, the other member say it's good and the other one say it's not delicious but fuzzy logic is in between so uh, means that it is not that good but it's not that bad means like that so fuzzy logic use if then okay so uh, and then this is the, the fuzzy logic design and then we have the input diagram for this, this one is for figure 1 we have the degree of membership we have 3 the input the both two input have 3 degree of membership but the output we have 5 degree of membership 5 degree of membership all of the membership we can change it we can change the name so, so this is the rule. If the water level is okay, then do not adjust the valve. Number two, if the water level is low, then open the valve quickly. Number three, if water valve is high, then close the valve quickly. Means the first three rules only adjusted on the valve. But the other two is when the water level is near to the set point means if the water level is okay and increasing then close the valve slowly and the other one if water level is okay and increasing then open the valve slowly okay so this is the demo for the, the tank tank demo as you can see we can change the input so it basically run based on the input that we already put up, put in, and then we have the comparison. Okay, so uh, basically fuzzy logic is more functioning well to the water tank level. Means it's not water, for the water tank, mostly people use the PID. But for combined tank, it's more complicated, so they use fuzzy logic to make it 
more easier so so they can know when there's a problem uh, they don't have to change all the things back or anything else they just use puzzle again so that's all from our group thank you